Hi, people of hope. It is Pastor Sarah with your daily devotional and your word of encouragement. I am recording today from my office because of that right there. That's a word board. And right there it says Psalm 4610, be still and know that I am God. Boy, all you have to do is open up a news app, the newspaper, turn on the TV, or even go on social media and reminded yet again how deeply divided our nation is, our world is, and even just our small communities that we live in. Um, There's so much going on in this world, and, and perhaps you find yourself discouraged. Perhaps you find yourself weary of everything that's been going on. Maybe you're even just done with all the decisions that you've had to make the last six months with regard to this pandemic and and you've been making decisions you never thought you'd ever have to make before and you're like what in the world and you're just tired <laughs> well I want to remind you what that psalmist wrote about how you were created you were created to rest in God you were created to find your hope to find your strength and to find your peace in God and all you have to do is be still Amidst our busy lives, one of the most important things we can ever do is to be in prayer with God because he wants you to be still and know who he is. Know that he is the God of the universe and he has everything in hand. He wants you to know that he is your true strength and your true peace. Psalm 29, 11 says this, the Lord gives strength to his people. The Lord blesses his people with peace. The Lord wants to do that for you today. So I want to encourage you to take time in prayer. Spend time with the Lord today. Jesus says it this way. He makes an invitation. He says, come to me, all who are weary and heavy burdened, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. Take my yoke, for my yoke is easy and my burden is light. People of hope. The Lord can be your strength and your peace today. The Lord is your strength and your peace. Turn to him in prayer. For as that old hymn writer put it, What a friend we have in Jesus, All our sins and griefs to bear. What a privilege to carry Everything to God in prayer. Oh, what peace we often forfeit. Oh, what needless pain we bear. All because we do not carry everything to God in prayer. Be in prayer with God today. Let him be your peace and be your strength. Be still and know that he is God. God bless you, people of hope.